Hey guys, it's Con for College Studios here, and this is the video I really was hoping I wouldn't have to make, but we do have the official confirmation from the park regarding flash vertical velocity, and unfortunately, it will be delayed till 2025. If you guys watched my most recent flash update, I hinted at the fact that this was probably not far away from being announced, and lo and behold, here it is. So I'm going to read the official park update here. It says, we are thrilled with the opening of our new Savannah Sunset Resort and Spa, along with the major enhancements made to our iconic giant, giant wheel, our all-new Safari Base Camp, and the excitement of the new Fright Fest Extreme debuting this fall. When it comes to delivering fun and safe attractions, we won't rush the construction process. That means we're moving the official opening of the Flash Vertical Velocity at Six Flags Great Adventure to 2025. We appreciate your patience and understanding. We're confident it will be worth the wait. So this is a very interesting way they decided to word it. And specifically, I want to look at the fact that they use the word official opening. So I don't want to jump to conclusions right away because, of course, it's very obvious this ride will not open until 2025. They just said it. But the fact that they're saying that the official opening of the ride will be in 2025 makes me hopeful that maybe we could see some kind of a pass holder preview type thing happen at the end of 2024. I mentioned this on our live stream we did the other night, as well as in my other flash update. I think the smartest way they could go about this would be to have the ride open for just pass holders during, say, Holiday in the Park, which typically isn't a super popular time at the park. It's not always super busy. That way, you please 2024 pass holders who may have just purchased a pass for Flash Vertical Velocity, and you can also incentivize 2025 pass holders to buy a pass for 2025. That way, they can get access to Flash early in 2024 again. That is nothing official. That's just something that I have in the back of my mind as a good idea. But I do find it also interesting in this park update that they don't mention Log Flume at all. There's no mentions made to it. And they did mention the enhancements made to Giant Wheel. As far as I know, it is still on track to open in 2024. But yeah, unfortunately, Flash will be delayed till 2025. Uh, I know this is not the news we wanted to hear or maybe some of you guys weren't expecting it. I, like I said, I kind of saw this coming for a little while. I was holding out hope that it wouldn't happen, but I think what really wound up happening was with the merger, a lot of these projects kind of got hung up with the finances of the merger. And of course, when you're merging two giant conglomerates into one massive one, you're going to have a lot of budget issues and things of that nature. And unfortunately, I think Flash wound up being a victim of that. It doesn't help that the ride was a last minute addition. They said it when they first kind of hinted at the ride even being a thing, that they were able to get it last second for the park. And typically, last-minute additions aren't going to make it for their planned opening, and that, of course, wound up being the case here, which is really unfortunate, but that is going to do it for this kind of a downer of a video. At least Flash will eventually open. <laughs> we can look at it that way, right? At least it's not canceled. But we are going to have to wait just a little while longer until we can ride Flash Vertical Velocity, a great adventure. With all that being said, guys, if you enjoyed, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye, guys.